Yo guys, what is going on? It's Aces here today with another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about why Zero wasn't added to the Specialist Headquarters and if Zero will be added to the Specialist Headquarters. So, quite honestly, we do not know really anything about Zero. We don't know any backstory. She hasn't been in any other game. She hasn't been Black Ops 3 Specialist when the Specialists were introduced. So, we're kind of in the dark, uh, intel-wise, on anything about this girl. So, um, you know, my first thought was, hey, Specialist HQ, and that's how I was going to do my abilities. If you guys saw my abilities video, you can actually go into multiplayer and you can view Zero's abilities and like her main and then her equipment, the EMP grenade, which I'm going to show you guys here really quick. So you just um, go to your personalization and then if you would select Zero, you can actually um, see what she does over here in the special issue. You can see her weapon and her EMP disruptor grenade. So you can also, you know, do the whole preview thing, but um, you know, it's just a little cut scene here. We're not getting any real intel um, on any background about this girl. So it really leads the question to if we will get any backstory intel on anything about her. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with the Specialist HQ too much, there's various intels you can unlock. When you do a one of the main Specialist HQ missions, you get a main piece of intel, which builds a little bit of the story for um, you know unlocking the just a main storyline of the specialist HQ, which you see right here. Now, my theory is either maybe the MISC section, miscellaneous, or the Intel section might get a little bit of an update if, um, you know, zero gets added into here. But one main concern for me is since we have all these specialists, this is where, you know, really, really new players come to learn how to use specialist if they so choose to even be curious enough to click specialist HQ. It is just a little box up in the top left. But for the people that do do it and you know are challenge do all the challenges and stuff, they've gone through all of these missions and they know the whole nine yards on everything about it. So Zero definitely needs specialist HQ for multiple reasons. For people who don't understand how the specialist works, if um, you know people want to continue to learn the specialist, and you know the missions were kind of interactive. We had stuff with Woods, and we had you know a bunch of dialogue from Woods, and it was just like an, the single player mode is really really nice. If you haven't checked it out yet, I think I did the whole entire thing on my channel. I might have to go back and find like one or two of the specialist um, episodes I didn't upload, but. You know, the specialist, it was really interactive for a single player part of the game since the campaign was cut. So, you know, if Zero was added into this, you could open up the possibility for more specialists in the future, a whole new campaign, or continuing on to something else after the small storyline that was created here. So it's going to be really interesting to see if um, they decide to do anything with the intel, because if you guys go into, um, you know, the call sign and everything, you are getting the name, the date of birth, your nationality, designation, and their bio literally all here in the Specialist HQ, and that is lacking for Zero. We can't even find out her full name. So it's going to be really interesting to see if the backstory is added in maybe two weeks. I hope it is, but that is the current situation on Zero's backstory. We have none. So guys, let me know what you're thinking. Everything you that's on your mind, you think we're going to get a backstory, you think they just kind of cut it and they didn't have time for it, what are you guys thinking? Leave it in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you have to say. But that is going to do it for me. If you did enjoy today, leave a like. It helps me out a ton. Subscribe if you're new. Check out the sponsors and equipment I use in the description below. That's all I got, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I'm out.